So first of all, thank you very much for coming. This is a really exciting day for us. Um, the Teaching with Technology Fair started about two years ago uh, when we created a faculty day. And um, we thought it's a great, we need to have a day where faculty can showcase the great things they're doing in the classroom and uh, can share with their colleagues what you're doing with your students and talk about it, demonstrate, and inspire each other. Um, so you can work together on collaborative project and um, just have a good collegial um, outlet to find out what the professors in other disciplines are doing. So um, the last time we had Teaching with Technology Fair, we created a bunch of tables showing you what technology we have on campus, and that was mostly FCPE staff who were sharing technology with you. And we got very good feedback. Really, uh, professors really liked the uh, format to be able to walk around and take your time and see what we have. But we thought, how great would it be if not we are presenting, but if you're presenting? So um, we started to find, to look out for colleagues and professors who do really exciting things in the classroom and uh, provided a, um, a forum where you can share your material. So here we are. We are really excited. We have 16 professors who were. Um, willing to share and to work with us and to present their materials and activities. We, we're starting out with the first session right now. Um, you, will, you will see there are eight tables, eight stations here. So we encourage you to just walk around and talk to your peers, ask questions, look what's out there. Uh, we also have a handout for you that explains exactly what, what sessions and what topics will be presented at what time. So that's the first session that starts out right now um, and ends at about 2.15. Then <coughs> just to make it a, a little bit more exciting even, we have um, a little break planned with raffles. For those of you who are interested in technology, we have um, a few items such as flip cams um, and uh, conference speakers, to, so you can do Skype and other um, exciting voice applications on the internet. So we raffle them away about 2.15, and then 2.30 we start the second session, where another eight faculty members um, will be staffing our different booths, and you can walk around again and have a conversation. And afterwards, <coughs> we will have another raffle session and say our goodbyes. So for now, I want to thank you so much. Um, give a great, great thank to the presenters who are here today. Um, and who are brave first pioneers in, in sharing their materials and, and in, in working with us. And we don't want to leave our presenters empty-handed, so they're, they're getting a very nice special application today. Everybody who's, who's sharing their materials today is receiving a flip cam. So I think this is a great tool for you. And of course, that means that next year round, you will be coming back <laughs> and have much more to present and much more to show. So thank you all for coming, for participating, and for making this a really uh, fun and useful, valuable sharing experience about teaching and how we can serve our students by using technology very well. Thank you very much and enjoy. And if I want to cite them in an article, I just click on yes. oh, no, you, no. well, their movie person, one sentence. I think it was a wonderful opportunity for faculty to see what other faculty were doing and to engage personally with them. And so the small groups, the way you had it set up, was really nice. I'm, the only bad thing was not enough time, as usual, the feedback and then having uh, the group, you know, like people hear what others were doing. But other than that, I think it's a great way to present, you know, that new technology for faculty. And they will be reference list and they'll be Right now, the style is a style. So it's great. We've had some questions on the topic, and I'll be interrupting. Yeah. Yeah. And sometimes I will. 
I was a presenter at the Teaching with Technology Fair at Delphi University, and uh, it was really a wonderful experience. We had tables set up with all different uh, professors showing what they were doing in class, and I had the opportunity to demonstrate uh, and show podcasting with iTunes, which I used in my classroom, and the students seemed to get a great deal of benefit out of it. The faculty that came by on the Technology Fair Day uh, were very interested in how it was used in the classroom, how it could help them. Uh, we had a good turnout with a lot of interest from everybody that was there, and it was easy to present because you were presenting to your uh, colleagues that were very interested in anything they could learn to improve their teaching techniques. I typed in images in a PowerPoint, I inserted a new slide, then I inserted a tape, I clicked on a cell, I did the shade. It's, it's intuitive. And if you get confused, I have It was a really great experience to talk with other faculty. Um, I think one of the most common questions folks had was, you know, is podcasting something that ends up making students attend class less frequently because they feel that they can just listen to the podcast at any time. Really, we had a lot of folks come from different areas of teaching, folks from arts and humanities, um, nursing sciences, education, etc. Um, and there were a lot of good questions about what kinds of um, different ways of recording podcasts exist, like using GarageBand, for example, which um, Alexis helped one of the faculty uh, to look at a little bit, um, as well as how the Adderalls work um, and how easy they are. We had them there so we could demonstrate how easy it is to create a recording um, and how incredibly fast the um, iTunes aspect is because it, it goes right online. Um, it gets uploaded quite quickly, which is really helpful. Um, I believe Maureen's point was different kinds of learners, you know, folks who are really auditory in their learning. It was really useful for them. Exactly. So you can pick which was perfect. Right. So I can see They presented about Google Docs and it was very interesting that a lot of people are not familiar with all the features of Google Docs and they were just amazed what it can do. So I think it was a very enriching presentation all in all. Just log in there. I was at a conference just a few weeks ago, the April conference, and I was in a room with three of my ex students and graduates. For two hours, I had to do a live chat and I was Okay, so I can see what what this person's done. What, so I can go over here and I say, okay, this person hasn't even done anything on the two. They do not like math. This this uh, this student does not like math. They haven't even tried these quizzes on math. But she much had a great aunt. I was very impressed with the tech fair. I thought it was a great opportunity to showcase a variety of options that a lot of professors don't know about, from Moodle to video in the classroom to uh, anti-cheating, um, anti-plagiarism software. Uh, it was such a nice, concentrated way to get a great deal of information out. Um, I thought everybody that presented, with very few exceptions, did uh, an excellent, my exception being myself, did an excellent job. Um, and I thought people were getting their questions answered. Um, and I, I think it will set up the basis for doing future tech fairs effectively. You know, you click on me, you type in, so we'll type in library science. And you don't know, you might be following. Thank you very much, everybody, for attending. This was a huge pleasure for us. Um, we hope we have many, many of you uh, presenting next year because this is going to be an annual event, and I hope it's going to get even bigger and better and, and um, ex more exciting every year. But thank you very, very much um, for, for being great sports and for sharing your innovative teaching technologies. And um, come and see us if you have any questions, any ideas of other things you would like to do, and we look forward to continue working with you. Thank you.